And welcome back to Let's Play Harvest Moon Animal Parade. I finally found some gold. It only took 20 minutes of retrying. But anyways, we finally have some gold. Let's get out of here. Uh, gold spawns so rarely today. But now that we have gold, time to go turn this in. This should be the last thing we're missing. I don't think we need, like... Uh, I think we already turned in all the others. Only one way to find out. Also, at some point, I need to go buy seeds. But let's go see Ramsey. It would be nice to get fire back, just so I can start upgrading stuff. Alright, uh, where's my gold? There we go. This should be the last of what I need. Yes, it is. Well, time to burn some metal. Or blow it up. Hopefully the bell is more durable than it looks. Oh, that reminds me, tonight we should also start doing the yellow bell quest. So I guess we'll be staying up all day. And all night. Okay, I hope that thing is really durable. Huh, that was actually a nice catch. But yep, we finally got the red bell back. Looks okay. There we go. Alright, let's go put it back where it should be. I don't think we've ever actually been told that this would fix the fire, but... Okay, but yeah, it will fix the fire. Obviously, each bell is based on an element. So this is the red bell of fire. Let's go put it back. Oh wait, but first we got an event. Oh yeah! That's right, we never did meet the sprite of this spell, did we? He's not very happy. Actually, how long have they been kicking around that bell? Say hello to Alan. I like Alan. He's cute. And he might have asthma now. Uh, don't we have to put the red bell back before you can ring it? Yep, we do. Alright, we're heading back down into the mine. Well, that's one way to avoid the question, but yeah, we need to go back down. Or we could just hang on to it. But no, there's no point in hanging on to it. It won't let you sell it. Although I kind of wonder how much this would be worth. Also, hi, Snake. Alright, back down to floor 10. Luckily, we don't actually have to mine anything. Actually, you know what? Why not? While we're here, we might as well try to get some metal. Especially since we turned a bunch of it into junk. Because we have to refine it, which is kind of a stupid process, but oh well. Although I did clear out a lot of stuff already. You know what, screw it. Let's just go straight down. Uh, six. We should be around seven or eight now. Seven. All right, let's just find the stairs. Oh, wait, no. Put that away. Uh, where's my hammer? Also, I hear the mole around here somewhere. Where is he? I hear him. He's probably hiding under a rock. Oh, wait, no, there he is. 
Also, whenever you hit the mole, he drops food for you. Oh my god. He dropped really good food this time. Uh, yeah, we're gonna be keeping that, actually. No, don't, don't eat it. I've never seen anyone drop bottomizer before, but okay. Also, where are the stairs? They're probably hidden under a rock. Ah, oh, confusion. Let's see. You know what's good? Let's just do a crack. I don't care if it brings me up a few floors. Uh, are the stairs hidden again? Yeah, they're hidden. The one time I actually need to get down, the stairs don't appear. Oh, well, we, we reset the floor. There they are. Found them. At least these- Oh wait, copper. Although I think we have plenty of copper for once. The things that are rarest for me for some reason are copper and gold. We have plenty of copper now though. But we're finally down here. Let's put the bell back. There we go. Oh my god, that bell's a lot bigger than I thought it would be. That's nice. Ring the bell already. Actually, yeah, what did happen? Did someone actually steal the bell earlier? But anyways. Uh... 100? Let's make 100 friends. No, they're not gonna let us say anything except to ring the red bell. And with that, the bell should be rung. And now, fire is fixed. Also, by doing that, we basically unlock the rest of the mine. But that's one bell down. Also, we need a picture of this. Let's see. I need to get in the good angle. There we go. So yeah, red bell is fixed. And with that, we actually get a lot of unlockables. So, let's see. Anything else around this area we can do? Nope. Let's head back up. Let's go back up to the first floor. Because now that fire is fixed, we have a few unlockables. Uh, like now we can actually forge new items. Which is good. Also, I think this should be fixed by now? Or is it later? Yep, now we can go up. Uh, the upper mine is basically rarer stuff than the lower mine. We'll go explore it later. But I've kind of had enough of mining for now. So let's go see Ramses. Also, I think now we can actually buy food from the inn, now that they can cook again. Because before they were having a problem with their stove not actually working. So let's go check in. Also, one other thing has been fixed, but we'll see that once we get back to the farm.
it looks the same as before. But yep, now we can upgrade to copper and silver. Before we could only go up to iron. Although I don't have any iron ore with me, do I? Actually, yeah, do I have any iron ore with me? No. Let's just check the cost real quick, because I do want to upgrade my watering can at some point. Uh, 3 iron and 2400. Alright, got it. I might have the iron at home. Might being the keyword, because the majority of it could turn into junk. But oh well. We do have 2,000 gold to spend, but I kind of want to save it to spend on upgrades and new buildings. Also, at some point, I do want to buy a sheep. But for now, let's head home. Oh, I do, do need to buy more seeds today. We're kind of running low. Uh, probably more lettuce. Because we're going to need to start turning in lettuce for that quest. I don't remember how many more we need, though. But yeah, I do want to buy a lamb at some point. You know what? Screw it. We're going to buy a lamb today. The lettuce can wait. We'll just buy lettuce seeds with whatever money we have left over. But anyways, when we restored fire, we also restored one other thing on the farm. Uh, let's see, it's right over here. We already looked at it before. Oh wait, that's an herb. Anyways, we looked at it before. Remember the hot spring from earlier? Well, now that fire is back, it works again. And we can use it to restore our stamina, but we're not going to do that right now, because we're still pretty good on the uh, stamina front. It'll restore almost all of your stamina if you use it. Also, let's cover the fields out a bit. How many more seeds can I fit in? Uh, I want to do another row here, so it's 8 across, right? So 8 plus 5. Oh wait, no, plus 6. I didn't notice that blank spot. So 14 uh, bags of seeds. Whatever I can afford, basically. Also, at some point I went ahead into town and started giving people some tea. And considering we're going to be staying up all night today for the Yellow Bell, we have plenty of time to kill. But anyways, let's get over to Flute Fields. Oh wait, I forgot. Uh, I need to get the key for Fugue Forest while I was here. Or while I was at the Mining District. Oh well, go again tomorrow. There's no time limit on that, although it would be nice to start getting wood. But I kind of want to build up my money base before I start investing energy into wood. So yeah, we'll get the Fugue Forest key tomorrow. If I remember, which I probably will. Or won't. Who knows. But let's go get a lamb. I should be able to afford one. Only question is what to name it. Also, I see Renee. Let's give her something, because uh, we should probably give her and Kane some stuff. Let's see. I have a bunch of berries with me. Might as well start using them. Also, I forgot to put away all my stuff. Whoops. Oh, but wait. That's copper. Why am I giving her copper? She likes it. Uh, as for Kane, let me see. What do I have? Let's give him a blueberry. Why not? No, don't eat it. Give it to him. He's okay with it. I forget if he likes tea. But yeah, Fugue Forest is kind of a maze. Although it's not that hard of a maze. It's like the Lost Woods. We'll see once we actually get in there. But anyways, time to make a new friend. It's our reward for restoring fire. Although the next one I probably want to restore is uh, the Yellow Bell, which I think is Wind or Earth. But let's buy some livestock. Also, I need to buy some new, some more uh, chicken feed, don't I? Oh, I could... No, let's... Oh, that's right. Sheep can produce milk in this game, can't they? I forgot about that. But let's buy a lamb. 
Uh, what do we want to name her? Or him. Apparently it's a him. Or a her. I'm just gonna keep going until I see something I like. Hoffman, no. We could name it George. Oh, okay, we'll name it Nina. Alright, and, oh wait, uh, what's my chicken feed situation like? Also, stop going to the map, me. Uh, how much chicken feed do I- Oh, I only have- Oh, no, I have three, never mind. I was looking at the number of chickens. Uh, but I might as well buy some more. Let's buy, like, eight. Although I have just been letting, uh, what did I name my chicken again? Karen. I've been letting Karen just go out and graze on the grass. Just to save on chicken feed. But it's good to have a good stock in case it starts raining or pouring. Or hurricaning. Although it doesn't hurricane during the spring. Anyways, we have 300 gold. Let's go see how many seeds we can buy. Probably not too many. But who cares? We have a lamb now. We'll go take a look at her when we get back. Uh, she's probably not going to be going outside today, though. Hey, Ruth. I wish to buy... Uh, how much are lettuce seeds again? 40? Alright, we'll buy 7. And, uh, I guess one bag of... Tulips. Alright, we're down to 3 gold. I think that's a new record. How much gold was it that I ended up with before? I think 3 is the lowest we've been. I don't know why I'm trying to top myself on how much money I could spend. But it's an investment. Everything I've been buying will pretty much pay off in the long run. But for now, let's head home. We have to get the stuff from the ground. And then I think I'll spend the rest of the day in town. Uh, waiting for 6 o'clock. Oh, I should probably actually grab the Yellow Bell while I'm home. So the three spots we'll need to visit are the mines, the field over here. And there's a spot in town. I don't think we've actually seen the spot in town yet. But it's near the lighthouse. But let's just head back. Also, we should probably check in on our new sheep. Or, sorry, lamb. She's not a sheep yet. She has some growing up to do. Also, Ellie should be growing up sometime soon, I think. I forget how many days it takes them to grow up. I think it's like 10 to 20. But Emily should be wandering around outside. Also, we should probably get a milker and some clippers at some point. Also, I think that lettuce is ready. Nope, never mind. Alright, let's go take a look. Uh, where is she? There she- You're in Ellie's spot! Get out! But yeah, this is Nina. She's so tiny. Let's just get her some food and some love. And I think- Why can't I brush her? There we go. And I think we'll end the episode here. So, next time on Let's Play Harvest Moon Animal Parade, I'm gonna go get all my crops planted in the ground between episodes. And then we're gonna head into town for the rest of the day. So we need to wait until about 6 before we can start powering up the Yellow Bell. So, till then.